Yo, what's up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking Jealousy 4 here, bring guys more Meta 15 Ultimate Team today. We're gonna be coming back from a loss. Yes, last game, you know, we pretty much have a did have a major screw up, and uh, I'm gonna wake up from that. I gotta step up a little bit more. I gotta step my game up. Also, my defensive side, it has to become better. And I did take some tips from my brothers, and uh, they told me to play this, play that, and you know, some other formation. And that's what I'm gonna try now. And uh, you should be able to see it a few times in this gameplay. Because, uh, you know, I was trying it out, but I was turning back into my old defense and, you know, I was going back and forth. So, uh, it, it, it was um, a total mix up in the defensive side. On my offensive side, I was playing tricky offense. I usually play power offense, which just means, like, I just run the whole damn time. And I expect Doug Martin and Marshall Lynch to do all the work for me. But this time, I was playing tricky offense. I was calling in new uh, reroutes and uh, new passing plays. So, keep an eye on, on that. Derek Carr, by the way, did a hell of a job in this game. Uh, another thing is that my opponent, his key player, was Cam Newton on his offense. And of course, what we always, when we always see Cam Newton, you always gotta have a spy or continue D line. Because if not, this guy's gonna scramble all the goddamn way, which he kind of did almost in some certain quarters. So, yeah, I had to keep my eye on Cam Newton because I know he was gonna pull some bullshit. So, um, another thing, his offense was kind of weird. I just couldn't, I couldn't read him half of the time. But you know, my defense alignment. Good thing they're awake. He got sacked a few times, and uh, this is what cost him the turnover. The turnover. So now we're leading three to zero in the second quarter. One minute and thirty-eight seconds to go. He puts he punts it into two. I was like, holy shit! I better call in the screen, and I did. Got like five yards ahead. Nice job by Doug Martin right there. Had to do a quick pass right there. Jason Morrow with a nice catch got me out of the goal line. Uh, another passing play called in. A little bit of a post star route. Another catch. This time from Mercedes Lewis. I'm surprised he didn't fumble. Like last time, he fucking major screwed up the last game. I was pissed off about that. And, um, you know, good thing he didn't fumble this time. I would have been like, fuck you, Mercedes Lewis. I'm just going to buy Dave Casper at some point. Because, uh, you know, sometimes tight ends do cost the game. Like, they'll drop the ball or they just don't ca don't keep their feet on inbound. So, yeah, tight ends, you know, they're, they're kind of dangerous to throw to. But at the same time, they're pretty much strong and tall as hell. Now watch this play guys, my special play, my favorite play in the playbook, I can only use it once per game. I pitch it out to Marshall Lynch and a touchdown 15 yards away. I never thought I was going to score from that far, you know, so. And uh, the, the, the the thing is that after that play was called in, this guy started to call his, his own option play. I was like, oh shit, what have I done? I opened the doors to hell, look at this, he pitches out, jukes out Reed. I couldn't catch up with that tackler right there. He takes it all the way for a touchdown. Sad. Sad, sad, sad. I knew I was like, I was like, God damn it. I opened the doors to hell, of course. So uh, it was kind of a wake up call. Like I know this opponent was going to call it in special plays too. If I call it my special plays. So um, anyways, I ended up back in the offense. Third and two to call in the screen. And my goddamn fat offensive lineman stands in front of the pass. I was like, God damn it. <sighs> I was pissed off. And right there, I know the flats was open. I know, I know, I'm dumb. We all have that moment, man. <laughs> I'm not the only one. We all have that one moment where we, like, take a pause and think about it. I was like, yeah, we saw that flat guy, but we should have don't throw it to him because, you know, we don't. We want the long yardage, but <sighs> I should have thought twice. So, anyways, he ended up doing the field goal anyways. We're still tied 10 to 10. Fourth quarter, four minutes to go. Had the ball back. Caught in a little bit of play action that I never called in before. Uh, Carell Patterson, nice route running to the to the to the middle, calling another passing play that I never called in before. The tight end is wide open towards the right side, juke him in, juke him out. Oh, Jason Morrow with the quick feet, unbelievable. Good for a white guy, by the way. Counter to the right side, Doug Martin with a quick feet. I'm telling you, I know how to freaking. I, I'm getting better at juking though, and it's getting a lot better along the way when I'm playing franchise, uh, the connected franchise. I'm, I have like a franchise going on with my brother, and it's pretty much awesome. And I've been practicing my jukes here and there. So, anyways, the run down the middle with Marshall Lynch. I'm surprised he got popped right there, man. I really need the higher version of Marshall Lynch. And once I get him, damn, my offense is gonna be a beast. So I ended up scoring 17 to 10, one minute and 40 seconds to go. Can he do it? Can he prevail? Got sick, but Jadavian Clowney, another chance going into offense. And what kind of pass was that? Lance Briggs ended up intercepting the ball. Touchdown all the way. Score is now 23 to uh, 10. And the guy ended up quitting. So, what did we learn from this game? That we got to keep our compulsion offense. I mean, we got to keep our cool and we got to see those open routes and the wide, I mean, on the, on the flats and, uh, 
you know, you should be able to get your ass saved sometimes if you guys throw it to the flats. That's the lesson of this gameplay. So, anyways, you guys like the gameplay? You guys got any comments about certain plays that I called in in my uh, in my gameplay? Please let me know in the comment section. I will answer them later. Um, anyways, uh, yeah, there's going to be more gameplays coming up. Subscribe for more if you guys want to see more Meta 15 Ultimate Team. And by the way, our current record, I believe, is 3-1. and one. I mean, 2-1. and one. Yeah, 2-1. and one. Sorry. So, I'll see you guys later. And subscribe for more Madden 15 Ultimate Team.